In this tutorial, you are going to learn what is an absolute path which is different from the opposite type of path, a relative one. An absolute path details where a file is stored in your computer in your specific file structure. As you can see here, we have a Windows Explorer window open and you can see we have located a file within the My Pictures folder. Right click on this file and click Properties. The Properties window will open and next to the Location field you can see the location of the file. This is an absolute path and this is indicated by the fact that the entire path is present and the username is included in the path. Even if someone had the same photo on their computer in the Pictures folder, this link would not work for them. This is because it is absolute and only relevant to your computer. For comparison, a relative path would not have so much information. It might just be as simple as backslash pictures, indicating that the user needs to go to their pictures folder. As you can see in this image, a relative path is indicated by two full stops. This means that the user has to go to the location on their specific computer where they installed the files.